This is the Manning Primary School in the centre of the frame in between those two gum trees there you can see the school gardens and the vision is that this area in between the school and the bushlands would have bush tucker species planted that could provide shade for the car park and an interpretive bush tucker walk alongside and around the BMX track that the kids have. People walk through quite often and unfortunately some of them drop rubbish. So instead of weeding and planting and stuff like that in the bushlands, we spend some of our time picking up the evidence that some people see our country as a rubbish dump and an ashtray. Well, I would like this land to be have a 20 year lease to the city of South Perth so that the South Perth Council can spend money on the um, pathways and the fencing and to get more of the bush back and, and look after the rubbish and they are very capable of doing that sort of thing so that's what I would really like the council to be able to do and people love to walk through here and I think we just should um, make it the best it can be. The local people enjoy this area very much. Well there's always people walking through. Yes, that's right, that's right. And they like to see the flowers that you've planted and, uh, and hear the birds and so it, it's quite an asset for this area. Yeah. And I think if the council could take responsibility for the management, that would be so good. It's already beautiful and it could be so much nicer and so yes. much more useful to the local community. Yes, yes, that's right. Oh, well, back to the weeding. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you the weeds. <laughs> so it's a bit like a meditation, sitting next to the same plant, patiently pulling out introduce weeds, Warwick. That's right. Um, I've been pulling these things out for 20 years, I'd say. 20 years? <laughs> and I'm s they're still here. They're still here. And so are you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I suppose won't be around forever, so it'd be really good if, the, if someone could care for the bush, someone else, rather than just leaving it as a holding operation like we're doing at the moment. Well it needs the whole community engaged, doesn't it? Yes, or a fair bit of it. This is a community asset. It is, but uh, the community doesn't really understand bushlands. Have a good one, mate. I'll let you get back to it. You're doing a great job. <laughs> so you can see Angela over there is doing more weeding. And those weeds will go back to the Sun Worm Farm Gardens. And Warwick over there listening to a bit of music and doing the same thing. And of course all through this area more plants that Joan's propagated. Most of them are ones that she's propagated from plants from this area, which is really beautiful. <laughs>